you may be looking forward to the total solar eclipse. But what about animals? We don't really know actually how the animals are going to interact. The Dallas Zoo is going to learn how they react to the sudden darkness. When it gets dark, then we see certain behaviors. Manager of Applied Behavior Christine Montgomery says it's a bit of their own science experiment. Birds will tend to nestle down on their perches. The animals will start to move toward their night houses um, to get their dinner and go to bed. So we might be seeing some of those anticipatory behaviors, but we're just learning uh, like everybody else is going to be here to learn. Over at the Fort Worth Zoo, Associate Mammal Curator Melissa Blair says she does not think they will be as amused as humans. We're kind of thinking that they're not going to look. You don't typically look up towards the sky unless they see something that's super strange or not normal. They're so used to airplanes and a lot of the other noises and a lot of the birds and whatnot that they're kind of used to seeing a lot of that stuff. We're not really anticipating them to look at the sky. They may be a little curious, but I don't anticipate them truly like staring. Either way, staff will be on standby to find out. What we're going to do on the day of when it comes time to it, we're going to have staff kind of placed throughout the park. And so if any of the animals do act a little off or confused, then we'll go ahead and ship them off exhibit. And Montgomery says that just may be the case. I think about the African crested porcupine. They spend a lot of their day inside their den. Especially for nocturnal animals. And that will be an interesting one to see if they come out of their den uh, to be more active and then four minutes later go back in their den. <laughs> But while the porcupines may retreat, the crickets will come out to sing. It's possible outside with the natural occurring insects that the crickets will start um, going off as they do when the sun starts to go down. Other insects might start flying. Um, it'll, yeah, it'll be interesting. Julia Falcon, CBS News, Texas.